Amazon Relational Database Service, or RDS, is a fully managed database service in AWS, and read replicas are a feature of RDS that enables users to create one or more replicas of their primary database instance. Hi guys, this is Abhi from GokchaDB, and in this video, you're going to learn six things about RDS read replicas in AWS. Let's get into it. Number one, read replicas can be used to improve the performance and durability of your database by offloading read traffic from your primary database instance to one or more replicas. The replicas are exact copies of the primary database instance and are kept in sync using asynchronous replication technology. Stay tuned, there's more to come. Number two, read replicas are available in RDS for MySQL, MariaDB, PostgreSQL, Oracle, SQL Server, and Amazon Aurora. Attention! Number three, you can reduce the load on your primary database instance by routing the read queries from your applications to the read replica instance. Read replicas allow you to elastically scale out beyond the capacity constraints of a single DB instance for read heavy workloads. Giddy up. Number four, read replicas can be promoted to become standalone RDS database instances in their own right, which can be useful for scaling out your database or for disaster recovery purposes. Keep your formation! Number five, when you create a read replica, Amazon RDS sets up a secure communications channel using public key encryption between the source DB instance and the read replica, even when replicating across different regions. Howdy, partner! Last but not the least, number six. While read replicas can help improve the availability and performance of your database, they're not a substitute for backups. This is because if you run a bad query on your primary instance, your read replica will also inherit the bad changes. No! There you have it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Until next time.